we've had uh, videos sent in to us as well. So they are very common, but yes, yeah, still pretty dangerous. So be careful when you do see them. Uh, storm alert is moderate. There is an excessive heat warning as well. That's continuing to impact everyone across southeastern Arizona. So it is going to be a very hot day today, hotter than yesterday. So don't let that catch you off guard. Start hydrating right now. This lasts until 10 p.m. on Wednesday for all the areas highlighted in pink. Temperatures continuing to range from 106 to 114 degrees. So we might see some dust devils today. Current temperatures mainly in the 70s and 80s right now. So feeling not bad, but a little bit warm. 60s and 70s to the south and east, but high temperatures today are going to be brutal. We're pushing to about a 111 at the airport, 114 up towards Marana and Aver Valley. So very, very, very tough day for you all. 106 for Vail and Corona Day Tucson, 110 on the east side. To the south, 104 for Nogales, upper 90s in Bisbee and right around 103 in Tombstone. So pretty hot all across the board, but excessively hot for some of us. What we are tracking on top of the heat, of course, are monsoon thunderstorms. We have another round on tap today, but the best chance will be to the south and west of Tucson this afternoon. So kind of like yesterday, Santa Cruz County, Central and Western Pima County, you all have the best chance and the biggest impacts will be localized heavy rain. We could see some pretty gusty, maybe even damaging wind and blowing dust as well. And of course, the concern with this gusty wind is we've got a lot of uh, wildfires burning here in southeastern Arizona, and these gusty outflows could help spread those wildfires. I know that was a challenge yesterday. So we do have all those fires popped up on our map here, and this is 1 p.m. We're going to start to see a little bit of uh, thunderstorm spire up over the high terrain around that time. By 4 p.m., we could see some rainfall move over these fires as we work our way into the afternoon, which is good. But anywhere we see rain, we're going to have gusty wind, too. So it's going to be kind of a catch 22. By 6 p.m., we've got some rainfall kind of pushing along I-19, some heavy stuff. So if you're doing any traveling, commuting home around this time, keep that in mind. Some strong thunder thunderstorms potentially in central Pima County and then by 11 p.m. most of us will dry out and that'll be the case into early tomorrow. Forecast rainfall totals few hundredths of an inch for a few of us especially from Tucson to the west. Cells may be seeing the most with a little over a tenth of an inch but thankfully as we work our way towards this weekend we're going to have much better coverage. We're talking 60 to 70 percent chance for showers and storms almost every single day through the weekend so it is going to get a little bit more active this weekend. So if you have any outdoor plans you need to keep this in the back of your mind. They may get canceled or ruined thanks to some thunderstorms. Forecast rainfall over the next seven days. Very impressive. Areas south of Tucson could be pushing maybe an uh, inch and a half, two inches of rain, especially in Santa Cruz County. Here in Tucson, our total has gone up. We could see may maybe over a half inch of rain. So this is good news and it's great news for our temperatures too. We're going to be right around 111 today. That is uh, potentially beating the record high of 110 back in 2018. 110 for your Wednesday. Low chance for some showers and storms today, but as we work our way towards the weekend, again, coverage increases and temperatures drop. And we have a high of only 98 degrees this upcoming Monday. So we'll keep you updated as we get